Well, we are doing a canoe painting festival. It's actually a kind of a mural festival, but we're using canoes instead of normal wall murals and such. And uh, it's brought, the people that are putting it on this year are the Huntsville BIA, the town of Huntsville, and it's being organized by the Huntsville Festival of the Arts. So we have seven different canoes that were donated by people within the community. And we have seven different artists and we're all going to be working on Tom Thompson reproductions. Have you ever painted a canoe before? No, Scott, I have never painted a canoe before. I think I've put a, you know, slapped a coat of paint on a canoe just because it needed, you know, an old one, but I've never done this before. This is quite, uh, quite new for me. How are you finding it? You know, it's, it's the, it's the shape of it that's a challenge and it's also the trying to put an image on it on the shape and, and, like it's lying down it's um, yeah and it's it's um, industrial kind of paint it's so different than you know what I'm used to painting with acrylic so the original challenge of this whole project was like to what extent can you try and create the the, the reproduction of a painting when you you can't even start it with a square it's on a canoe so uh, for this project this year We've had every artist say, okay, well, like, do a variation and, and, and say, okay, so you picked the west wind or something, you could stretch it along the length of the canoe or cut some sections off and do it on the uh, vertical plane of the canoe. So that's what we're doing. People are taking their minds and choosing what to do and what not to do. And um, it's interesting because as you sort of pick a part of the painting that's integral to the original piece we're working from, then you get to move away from that stretching it along the canoe. It's a bit of a learning curve for me, but I'm really, really enjoying it. I love to paint, right? So you know that. <laughs>